quick review of the Bissell steam cleaner in less than 5 minutes. Here's a quick overview of the Bissell steam shot. I've used this product to clean a leather couch and here's my review of how well it works. And when you unpack it comes with a number of accessories such as the tool for cleaning windows. Uh, it has a number of attachments that allow you to scrub away grime and dirt. And there is also a scraping tool. Very simple to use. Basically you just fill this little container up with water. Honestly it does not hold a lot of water so it's for smaller projects. Not recommended for cleaning a couch like I did because you'll end up just refilling it over and over. Simply unscrew the cap at the top. Pour in the water until it's all the way full and then you just take the cap and screw it back on. To make sure it's tight you just push down on it towards the end and seal it. Plugs right into the wall outlet. There's a little indicator light that will turn on and you have to wait until that light turns off to know it's ready to go. This device comes with a very long cord so you don't have to worry about plugging it into an extension cord, it reaches very far. Once the little indicator light is off, you are good to go. At the end of the unit there is the lever that releases the steam. You just push down on it and get to work. Now the downside is if you're using the extension hose like I am in this video, you basically need both hands to operate it because you constantly have to press down to release the steam so you can't really do this with one hand. Would be nicer if the steam release was right on the handle but I guess for small projects you probably wouldn't use the extension hose and just hold the unit with one hand. It will have to reheat every now and then. You will notice the orange indicator light come on in which case you'll have to wait 10 or 15 seconds for it to reheat before you can continue using it. Once the water is empty you will notice there is no more pressure and you'll have to refill it with water. Now when you do that I guess it's recommended to turn off the unit because it will be hot. As you can see if you don't turn it off it will, the water will start to bubble out of the hole because it's boiling I guess. So don't do what I'm doing in this video. Just wait for it to cool down, fill it up, plug it back in. Overall it's a really great little unit. Very effective in getting stains out in cleaning surfaces. I guess it would be really good to use on hard surfaces and smaller items. If you want to use it to clean a couch or a carpet I would recommend using a bigger unit but for small jobs this is a perfect little cleaner that just uses steam no chemicals and a great little tool.